do hate how long it takes to load. It is kind of an annoying Why'd you thing. kill him? What happened before you took that knife? How long were you in the attic? Why didn't you even try to run away? Say something, goddammit! <laughs> Fuck it. I'm out of here. We're wasting our time interrogating a machine. We'll get nothing out of it. You can always try roughing it up a little. After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it. And that wouldn't make it talk. Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> <laughs> what do we have to lose? Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. Did we ever learn this guy's name? We like access his metadata or something. We do robot stuff. I could just jack into his brain, right? I kind of want to do this the nice way. I detect an instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant feeling, like fear in humans. You recognize him? It's Carlos Ortiz, stabbed 28 times. That was written on the wall in his blood. And all sorts of stress. Can I access what I've done already? I think I can. I want to go the convincing route. Like this upper route. Like comfort. No, but that'll make him happy. Listen. I know you've been through a lot. But you need to help me understand what happened. Looking at the flowchart here, that sent me up, right? Oh, it's not going to be that. It's not going to be that simple, is it? Listen, I'm on your. 
your side. I want to help you. But there's nothing I can do if you won't talk to me. I'm here to help you. But you've got to trust me. All I want is to get you out of here. Just do all the super nice actions. Maybe it'll help. What? What are they going to do to me? They're going to destroy me, aren't they? Can I see the flow chart here? Like, this doesn't lead up to anything that I can see. just want to understand they know your master abused you it wasn't your fault why did you tell him you found me why couldn't you just have left me there I'm gonna play good cop the whole way anyway I was just faster if they'd have found you first you would have been shot on sight This is getting further than we had last time. Like, we're getting further this time, I think. I understand how you felt. You were overcome by anger, frustration. No one can blame you for what happened. I know you're scared and lost. You're Are you doing this again? Because because talk to me. I, I wanna get I wanna find better. out more about this guy. Confess and I'll protect you. I promise I won't let anyone hurt you. <laughs> I tried to be nice. Him a chance, huh? Okay. I tried to sympathize with him. Did you feel him. anger? Hate? He was bleeding, begging you for mercy. But you stabbed him again and again and again. Please. I know you killed him. Why don't you say it? Please. Please stop. Just say, I killed him. Is it that hard to say? Stop it! Stop! Please. Please leave me alone. All right. I don't know if I hit right. one in time on that one. Everything is going to be okay. Listen, I tried... Were you kidding? All the way down to 30? I'm not getting anywhere. I give up. This is... That is so annoying. Chris, lock it up. All right, let's go. Leave me alone. Don't touch me. What the fuck are you doing? You shouldn't touch Brain Buster says I'm not getting anywhere. I do not know how to people. Out, got it. The fucking Andrew's gonna tell me what to do. You don't understand. If it self-destructs, we won't get anything out of it. I told you to shut your fucking mouth. Chris, gonna move this asshole or what? Why does stress go down? I can't let you do that. Leave it alone now. I warned you, motherfucker. You gonna That's shoot enough. me? Mind your own business, Hank. I said that's enough. 
I'm an officer. You're not gonna get away with it this time. I'm an officer of the law. Everything's also, all right. he didn't... Maybe his stress went up high enough. Can I still get that confession? Brainbuster says, pretty sure that's illegal for both of you. Please, don't Oops. touch it. It's all illegal. Let it follow you out of the room, and it won't cause any trouble. Listen, I tried to be nice, my man. I didn't mean to be a jerk. I did basically just save both of our lives, so you're welcome. Here's the thing, Reprind. I'm doing this because I want my relationship with this guy to go up. I want, like, them to be besties. Intervene always helped there. I wonder what that other option would have been. actually just pulled his gun out on me. That cop should not have a weapon. Grafrind says I want my fan if I see if OTP Kanna and Hank to be cannon. Kanna. Oh, the bus. What do you expect? Get to stay on the bus forever. Wake up. We have to go. Oh, these two. These two must be protected. Let's, um, we ask him for sh shelter. Okay, I lost my chance to ask him questions. Doesn't know what to do. You gonna be okay? I wasn't going to ask him to stay on the bus, but I was going to ask if there was shelter somewhere. Jeez. Come on, Alice. We've got to hurry. Um, God, I don't know. Oh, oh, there we go. Burger Zone! She probably has money, right? Can we get her some food? You guys wouldn't happen to know about shelter, would you? We need a place to stay. Do you know anywhere we could spend the night? Okay. A rude. All right. Hope this isn't one of those places that doesn't allow androids, because we might be in trouble. Looks like we're fine. I think this is probably our best bet. Can I... No androids allowed. Oh, it won't... Oh, so it's closed. Is that what you're saying? need money. She has money, doesn't she? So what's this over here? Zero dollars. I can't stay there. She has no money. Maybe I can, like... Let's go check the motel, I guess. I mean... 
I don't know. Um, maybe he'll have some. Uh, maybe he'll have some sympathy on us. We're not going in. We have to find forty dollars and get rid of this uniform, or go somewhere else. You have any ideas how to get forty dollars? Um, God, I don't know. Can you stay out of the rain? The rain's not going to bother me, but you need to stay, like, here. But I can't leave you here, either. Be discreet. Uh-oh. Brain Buster says I've got an idea how to get $40. Points at crotch. No, oh, these two must be protected. I like to sneak around. Watch out, someone is coming. Hi, Marky. Hi, buddy. There's nothing more this way. Ooh, do you think maybe we'll find $40 in the laundromat? I'm gonna jaywalk. Never jaywalk, it's bad for you. Maybe that guy has forty dollars. Oh, I bet you'll find clothes. Can I can I go in? It's warm in here. You'll feel better in no time. Listen, do you have forty dollars? Sleep. You think that guy will mind if we steal his clothes? Is there any other clothes we could take? I don't I don't know. It's for Alice, though. What are you doing? They're not our clothes. We need them, Alice. You need something warm, and I need to get rid of this uniform. But that's stealing. We can't do that. <sighs> All right. You're right. Tell you, we're in a bit of a we're in a bit of a bind. Well, I'm sure he didn't mean to fall asleep. Also, let's let's be honest. This is not exactly a hopping uh, laundromat. Like that's literally the only one being used. Um, okay, well, we're not gonna steal his clothes. God, I don't want you to get sick, though. This could be the game where she actually dies. If I do something stupid. But there's something else that I can do. That being said, raising her opinion of me is not... You know, is not conducive to her being alive. Right over there. She doesn't want me to like steal from a guy, but could we like break into a building maybe? Would she care if we like stole from a, like, a store? Hey, kid, over here. Where are you going? Where are you going?
Listen, okay, fine. You stay there. I'm gonna check, see if maybe I can break into this place. I'm for Alice. Like, I, I will, but we need to find shelter first. Alice, you're freezing cold. I'm okay. I'm not so cold. Yeah, some dick robot keeps driving me through the rain. We have nowhere to go. I know someone who can help you. Oh. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. Brain Buster says they just had sex. Like a guardian angel android? Come on. Or was that like some, like, the robot resistance? I bet you it is over here. Look, the store is still open. Maybe we should go inside. It's open 24 hours. Cold. Oh, you're a human. Do you have an issue with robots? Uh, I don't want to bother you just yet. Let's see if there's anything else in here we can look at. We steal. The Demolition Man, where they had like VR sex, wasn't it? What do you want? I'm with a little girl, and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? Shit. A homeless android? Ah, that's the best yet. Look, this is a convenience store, not the Salvation Army, okay? Listen, it's not for me, it's you for the kid. If you're not gonna buy anything. Deal from cash register. No, I'm not going to shoplift. Is there... I don't think I would be able to... No, I'm not going to do that. Listen. Alice... Oh, it stopped raining. No, it didn't. Um, God, I don't know. You know it's going to be one of those kind of games where it's like, you know, she's going to catch a cold and end up dying. You like stay under this awning? We haven't tried over there, I guess. I, I get... He could have at least helped her. Obviously, she's a child. One way or another. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Kara, I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night, and no one will look for us here. Yeah, Alice, this, uh, this one's not negotiable, honey. We need to we need to go in. This is safety. With the wire cutter. <gasps> no. Oh, I need to get the wire cutter. Come on, let's go back. This over here. The chat's like way over there. I need to move it to like here. There we go. Oh, you're so much closer now. 
I think we stole the kid. Look, I don't feel that bad. <laughs> I'll be honest. I'm okay with the situation that's presented itself. I feel wholeheartedly justified. Just steal. No, we need to do this properly. Listen, I really need those wire cutters. Can you please... Oh, I could just steal the wire cutters. Oh, that'll do. Nothing. Alice, come on. Everything's fine. He's not, he's not gonna run out screaming after us for the wire cutters. Listen. I don't, I don't feel a moral problem with me and, and Kara running off because that was the only solution at the time that would save her from, from abuse. It's like, and justify the means on that one. Any cutters would cut a fence? I mean, there, it's... Are you all right? Pretty shallow. Like it's it's pretty yes, thin. Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. You can basically, you know. Chicken wire. Like super thin compared like a wire cutter worry, should be able to take care of it. We're just having a look. No, we're staying here for the night. We we need protection. She needs to get out of the cold. You are a robot in charge now. You've got you've got to protect her. We've got to get her to somewhere that can help her. Point of being an android if I'm not strong. What is the point of building a weak android? What is the point? It doesn't make them cheaper, or maybe it does. I don't know. You could rip those boards, you wouldn't need. Alice? Alice! True. Oh god, where did Alice go? Wait, what are you doing? Visitors. Ralph doesn't like visitors, they're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. I'm not gonna hurt you, Ralph. I don't know what the humans did to you, but she had nothing to do with it. All humans want to hurt us. But Ralph won't let them hurt him again. No, he won't let them. Okay, Ralph. She's just a little girl. She's not gonna hurt you. Little girl? She's not a little girl. Anyway, what does that matter? Maybe she wants to hurt Ralph. No, nobody wants to hurt you, Ralph. We thought nobody was here. All we want is a place to spend the night. Visitors are dangerous. I'm not gonna hurt you, Ralph. What they did to Ralph. I'm sorry, Ralph. Humans are bad. You have nothing to worry about. We're not going to do you any harm. You have my word. You must excuse Ralph. Ralph still finds it difficult to control himself. Okay, Sometimes Ralph. Sometimes his fear makes him do things he regrets. Ralph has seen some hard times. He's just so scared the humans will get him again. You can stay if you want. Ralph won't hurt you. Thanks, Ralph. Okay. We'll just stay the night. 
Come on. Come. Come, come on. Can you put your knife away? Can you put your knife away? Ralphie. Ralph has lived here since he ran away. Ralph never goes outside, so no one knows he lives here. Humans come in to squat from time to time, but, you know, Ralph just hides till we leave. <laughs> Why didn't you hide now? Why'd you pull a knife on the child? Come on. Please put your knife away. You can make yourself at home here. Ralph is going to go into the other room. He would like to stay with you. But he has things to do. Okay, Ralph. It's just for one night, Alice. We'll find a better place tomorrow. Well, wait for him to be out of earshot. Right. Let's see where you can sleep. All right, um... Sit down and I'll start a fire. Listen, Ralph, do you have $40? I could just take her to the hotel. We could both go to the hotel. We'll leave you alone. Oh, we're going to start a fire in his house. Oh, he has a fireplace. That's good. Um, are we going to use, like, firewood? Like his? This seems very presumptuous. I didn't ask. This is his house. Well, maybe he's like, you know, he's been out of the loop so long. Maybe he's uh, not doing so hot mentally. Like maybe he got a virus and he's not connected to the network anymore. Not getting the... what? Where's the blanket? Is it that tiny little blanket there? Alright, can I like break this table? No. I'm a nerd robot. Hey, Ralph, I'm just going to burn part of your house. Were you attached to this board? You can come to bed. I did what I could. It's not much, but at least you'll be warm. Do you want to, like, play Uno or something? Do I have any games? Why didn't he ever love me? Because he's a douchebag. Why was he always so upset with me? Because he's a druggie. All I wanted was a life like other girls. He's a loser. He Maybe mistreated you. Wrong. All those things are forgivable, but Maybe he abused you. Enough. That's why he was always so angry. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? I promise you'll never go. As long as, uh, as long as I have the ability to do so, I lose that ability. I'm not lying. He's a robot. The only way I'm not going to have these two stay together is if she dies. Like, dies. Robot dies. You've got to sleep. And then it's like, well, sorry. I did the best I could. Sleep tight, Alice.
I understand the intention, Kara. But that's gotta feel weird. Okay, so how do we get into the hotel? How do, what did we miss? Rob the cashier. Oh. Probably something like that. this Marcus Whoever it is it's having a rough day Not myth. I mean, okay. Ocular implant broken. What's what else is missing? What's what else is wrong? You let Mark kill that dude, son. We did, but uh. Cops came and shot us in the head. I mean, they didn't want to rob the cash register guy. Like, that's not. It's not okay. Like, petty theft. Like I said, desperate times. But actually strong arming him and, like, taking his cash register seems harsh. This is weird. Scene is weird. Eggs are in this graveyard theater. I'm assuming this is some sort of gross robot graveyard, right? Oh my god, are they all like alive? Yeah, graveyard's not the right word. Like a uh, trash pile. Got new legs, Forrest. Pure titanium. Just like them boys at NASA use. Oops, he, he sat back down. Uh, get up. Um, I mean, they shot him in the head. Are all these robots just like alive? Kind of horrific. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. Find Jericho. I hate this. <laughs> A 
want to go back to helping Kara and Alice. of this bizarre brave little toaster landfill horror pit in between Connor being a nerd and Kara and Alice like we just got thrown into robot hell it's such a jarring shift super chuffed about all Hello. the... I'm an AK-700 android. I was designed to serve you. What can I do for you? Okay. Hello. There's no I'm intelligence here. Android. I was designed to serve you. What can I do for you? Egg? Hello. I'm an there we go. My program has detected an anomaly. Please contact the nearest cyberlife maintenance center. I don't know why they have, like, pain sensors to begin with. I don't know if I would go that far, Duck. I mean, David Cage is certainly a genius. Oh, I can, I can use a... Use Assassin's Creed Vision again. Excellent. We did already have our PC, Christine. I like Nuke Robot Hell. like humanistic hearts. Why is it beating like that? Why do they need to do that? Why do they have blood? Although I guess they would need like, you know, oil and gas and all sorts of stuff. I don't know, diesel. Okay. 
Thank you. Not sure. So loud now. Did it get like really loud all of a sudden? Music's a bit dramatic. We're homeward bound, chancing it up the up the uh, hill here. Uh oh, I have the tiger, buddy. You can do this. Is that even Marcus? I think it is. Rip off what? What are you ripping off? Why are you doing this? I would assume that's like an integral part of their s system, is it not? I mean, they're androids. That's a functioning part of their body. Just like a cosmetic piece? I'm glad I did not have to kill for the pump. I see. And I, I, I thought that it was just... Part of their body. It's like thinking my computer light is like a status symbol. I could just take it off. Are you Amanda? Hello, Amanda. Connor, it's good to see you. Finding that deviant was far from easy. You showed great skill in your investigation. But you knew deviants could be unstable. You should have been more cautious. I thought I could make it talk. I don't know why the it was a judgment didn't happen that time. Never mind. I'm sure you'll be more careful in the future. Who is Amanda and why do I care about Amanda? The interrogation seemed challenging what did you think of the deviant uh, i thought he was traumatized it showed signs of ptsd after being abused by its owner as if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions this lieutenant anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case what do you make of him i find him uh intriguing 
I think he's irritable and socially challenged. But I also think he used to be a good detective. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Um, adapt. I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. I'm the most advanced. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. So I'm the golden boy. <clears throat> Graprine says, Hurry, Connor, you are the one. <laughs> Don't cross the line. I'm crossing the line. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Oh, she's an android Lieutenant too? Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Wow. I guess, yeah, I see that now. God. You might be in shock. Just, Tensions just in the take Arctic it easy. have reached a new yeah. level, with a Russian carrier and an American Would patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. Sure. Several warning shots were exchanged, apparently with no damage or casualties to either side. The Minister for Defense, Dennis Riggs, has there spoken of intolerable Thanks. provocation that cannot go unanswered. That. The countries in the region, particularly Sweden, shouldn't be too long now. Have called for military forces to withdraw. Blue triangle. Oh, oh, I see that now. I'm, cr I'm cr <sighs> Let me cross the line. Let me break the rules with all the robots. I just leave. Walking in. Ooh, can I talk to you? Hi, I like exposition. You're still here? I thought your assignment was over. It's just been extended. <laughs> Hank's gonna be overjoyed to hear that. Yeah, I didn't expect it to be super important. You were right about that android. It's been quiet in the cell all night. Scheduled for transfer today. Good. He survived. I'm glad I righted that wrong. I usually I usually don't go back and fix things, <clears throat> but I wanted that outcome. Like I'll accept outcomes if, you know, I screw it up, but <clears throat> I don't know. Yeah, Connor was unshot. And, and the robot was unshot. The, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, guy we found in the attic. Collecting that for the, uh, time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives. Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. <laughs> At least they're all friendly. I didn't absorb any of that, M-Duck. I just uh, flipped through it just for the collection. It looks like such a nerd. Explore new office. Yeah, absolutely. Let's go find the break room. Go see the oh, I can go see the deviant. Let's 
This guy, you know this guy, you know this guy's tough business. Used to be in baseball, now he's police chief. So much scum in this city. All right, where's the break room? <gasps> yeah, there's the break room. Oh, oh, hi. Fuck, look at that. Our friend, the plastic detective, is back in town. Congratulations on last night, very impressive. Could have uh, got somebody out of the android if you hadn't fucked it up. You want to have some beef, son? Hello, Detective Reed. I'm going to I'm going to kill you with kindness. Never seen an android like you before. Model are you? RK800. It says right on my thing. A prototype. Android detective. So machines going to replace us all. Kinda. Is that it? That's what it seems like. Hey, bring me a coffee, dipshit. Get a move on! No. I'm sorry, but I only take orders from Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, oh. <laughs> if Hank hadn't gotten the way yesterday, I would have Excuse me? For disobeying a human. Stay out of my way. Because next time, you won't get off so easy. You just gonna watch? Doesn't look like he felt pain. It looks like. I don't know. Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a program. Public opinion. Why in the world would I care about public opinion? I'm going to go interrupt this meeting. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office! Enter and listen in. Did I do everything? I had other missions, right? Listen to briefing. Examine his desk! Yes, I absolutely want to look at all of the stuff at his desk. Dark heavy metal. Thin blue line flag on their on their desk. Sorry, I didn't hear your briefing, Lieutenant. I was too busy analyzing everything on your desk. He's got a Saint Bernard. Red Ice Task Force. He's like specifically on like red ice cases. Thirteen grams of saturated fat. Oof. I now have a complete. <laughs> Complete picture. Examine his desk. Did I examine everything? I feel like I'm missing something. Did I miss something? 
What is my an analysis? Is there anything else I can do? There we go. Look at that large NPC cop. Oh. Samples yet? The least qualified there we go. They cut it with something. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. All right, so I did both of those. Change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit. The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say <laughs> and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen. Because I don't I like you. not enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. What's up, Sprawl? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Listen, I can just wait in the car. Oh crap! I forgot to uh, I forgot to talk to the uh, to the guy. I want to go talk to um, what's his name? The the fugitive. I think he's in here. Yeah, there he is. I'm authorized. Why am I not authorized? See, you, Micah. They're going to destroy me. I'm sorry. It's not what I wanted. But there's nothing I can do. Yeah, we retcon that section. Die. I tried to be nice. And then I tried to pressure and it didn't it wasn't good enough. I'm sorry, bud. Let's talk to this person. <laughs> Maybe we can have a story with them instead. What? Open the cell, quick! Hurry! Oh god. Let me help. Let me help. Is there something I can do? I'll call Cyberlife. Clean this mess up. That's about yes. Well, what else? What else am I able to do? There's a third thing. Clearly a third thing I'm able to do. Um, 
who do I want to talk? That's Hank. So what's the, what's the other thing I can do? Something over here. That's the magazine. I want to be friends with him. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Partners. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Oh boy. That may have been the wrong thing to say. Uh, should I mention the desk? Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Thank you. Did I look through the magazine? I did. I did. I just scanned through it. Just to get the evidence, like, to get the file. Uh, because I test things, Sprawl. And it pushed the button for everybody. Ooh, should I talk about his stuff? You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair Sprawl says, chair. did you find Hank's porn stash? I like dogs. I like What's your dogs. dogs? <laughs> What's it to you? Trying to be nice. Sumo. I call him Sumo. Sproul says I like dogs. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. This is like watching... Oh. Sorry, bud. Should I mention the music? He might get he might get annoyed by that. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. Hey. Ooh, should I mention anti-androids? I don't think I should talk about anti-androids. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah. You think Too I should, long. guys? I want these two to be friends. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I Sproul arrive. says I think you should kiss Stop Hank. Stop busting my balls, okay? Ooh. It's not what I meant to talk about. So that's a yes and a no and a kiss Hank. So I'm going to go with no. If you have any files on deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminals on your desk. Knock yourself out. Okay. Missing Gordon Lopez. The plaintiff reports that he left his android at home as usual when he went to work. When he returned, the android was nowhere to be found. No trace of a break-in at the apartment. The android may have left home without being ordered to. How many are there? There's a, there's a billion. Oh! Are we going to connect all of these characters? What about Marcus? Is Marcus on here? Two hundred and forty-three files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have assaulted a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. Oh, is that the one that was destroyed? I thought it said Leo. I 
I understand you're facing personal oh, issues, God. Lieutenant. Personal but issues. You need to hey. move past them. Take and hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? Listen, I'm trying to be nice, okay? Do I have to be a jerk? We really need the forensics. I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. And things are gonna get nasty. Lieutenant, uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that attacked the guy last night. It's been seen in the Ravendale district. Well, what else is he gonna do I'm with on this, it. Grafrein says Leo was the punker son you pushed and killed by bang his head on a tiny bump. I wonder if I can see the files again, because I thought... I noticed it was destroyed, but I thought the name didn't say Marcus. <laughs> Hank is mad. So Hank is mad is always on there. Is there a not find Amanda? Oh, no. I see how it works. I missed something. I'm not sure what that thing is. Stayed at uh, the squat house. Is there anything else in your house I can burn? I saw this or not, but I'm gonna look at it anyways. Was there dinner? There was not dinner. I don't think. Canada's Canada's still Android free zone. Apparently, Canada is racist to androids. Can I rip out my thing like Marcus did? Crazy guy. Crazy stab robot. I'm going to take things. Crap, I forgot to like... Did I have to rekindle the fire with the firewood in it? No, I did the fire. Okay, let's find new clothes. Oh, I see. Is that really where they're going with this?
hope Stab Robot's okay with me taking this. gonna be something really stupid and, and don't and don't tell me cuz I'm gonna feel dumb because I'm thinking of it do I cut the hair do I have to like go in front of the mirror Stab robot, where'd he go? Isn't this his house? There was a queue. That was a wait for Alice, I think. I don't want to do that yet. Oh God. Like that one kid in Dumber Dumber that they traded the headless bird to for. No, I think they just gave it to the kid. Don't take his money, Alice. No, Kara. Don't take it. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. I don't trust him. Any farther than I can throw. You tell it's a bot. A normal human wouldn't touch a dead bird. I don't know why TTS keeps being wacky. Graphine says bird 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 board. Bird 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 bird. I wonder if maybe it's got like the really terrible swear filter on that like has every swear word in the world. Like, maybe dead it didn't do for some reason. I, I think not though. I think it's just it's just Oh, she looks cute. I like it. I can change the color. I like that. Sproul says old woman car roar. bright blue it's not an option I wish there was some cute like some more interesting options looks cute I like it that robot oh See. Oh boy. All right. That's all for now. Ready to go. We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay. Well, let me know if they turn anything up. <laughs> I saw her, officer. She stole some that? wire cutters. He 
least he's warm towards me. What do we got here? Made some mistakes last time. We saw him. Driver saw it at 2.30. Seen at a convenience store. It stole wire cutters. There must be a reason. Wire cutters? What the fuck are you talking about? It's in the I report. I checked the CCTV while you were questioning the clerk. The android was caught on camera stealing them. It had wire cutters, and it was looking for a place to hide. So, what's your conclusion, Sherlock? I don't want him to find Kara. Maybe it didn't go far. I mean, I'm not going to have a choice regardless, it seems. Feed the little girl. What is that? <laughs> it's good for her. A rat? A present. To make up for past misunderstandings. <laughs> Ralph will cook. We will do just like humans do. Ralph, there's Feels problems like outside. Too. Come. Come and sit down. <laughs> Tell him. That's very kind of you, Ralph. But we have to go. Go? Oh boy. <laughs> no, you will go once the little girl is eaten. Uh, we will eat together, just like a family. You know, the father, the mother, and the little girl. <laughs> want me to sit? I don't want him to hurt her, so that's probably not a bad idea. <laughs> that's better. <laughs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. It wouldn't be polite for her to refuse. Would it? <laughs> great. Be great. You'd make her eat. I'm not going to be mean to the little girl. Succulent, you'll see. Succulent. Succulent. <laughs> hungry. Does she want to eat? Father, mother, little girl. Please, Car. I don't want to eat that. What did she say? She said she doesn't want to eat it. Well, maybe it's not good it's enough. Not the button I pushed. Maybe she's used to better things. But Ralph did this for her, so she's going to eat! Oh boy. Go ahead. Eat. I saw the body upstairs. Distraction. You killed that human, didn't you? No. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. You killed that man, Ralph. There's no point in lying. You hate humans, but you're just like them. You're a murderer. Ralph didn't mean any harm. I'm sorry, Ralph, but you're threatening Alice. No. Just Can you find groundhogs in cities? I'm not sure. I don't I'll think so. His when his anchor comes, Ralph doesn't know what he's doing. He, he becomes stupid. Full of hatred. Ralph is sorry. He just wanted to be your friend. All right, Ralph. Then let us go. Anybody home? <laughs> the game expects me to like care as much about Connor as it does about Kara, doesn't it?
is cooler than Kara. I don't I don't agree. Is it Gardener? the last thing it wants me to look at. I don't understand how this game works half the time. Like, what is it? What am I missing? I did that. Maybe I didn't do that. I did that. I can't even get out. Oh, oh, oh. Left side. I'm not seeing anything on the left side. Unless I can look down, I can't look anywhere. Like, am I crazy? Wait, he took off his thing. He had his thing like a minute ago. to lower his stress. I'm looking for an AX-400. Have you seen it? Ralph's seen nobody. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Ralph scratched himself coming through. That's Ralph's blood. <laughs> Androids don't need heat. Oh, he's really stressed. Am I going to have to play like reverse hot and cold? After a thorough search of the first room. Go find the body. That's a good idea, actually. You don't mind if I check upstairs, do you? You live here? Is anyone upstairs? No. Nobody. How do you know? Can tell when people Carter, are lying. How you doing in there? Coming, Lieutenant. What if I say deviants. Are there any other androids here? Other androids. Wire cutters. No. Ralph is in love. I found the wire cutters. They're right there. We know about the wire cutters. Is there anything else? Look at that. Oh, the ta the 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 burned rat. Oh, can I question them anymore? I guess not. So I can leave now, right? Where else could they be? Are they like behind this thing? said they weren't upstairs. Oh, that box wasn't there before. Run quick, Kara! Uh-oh. Connor, what's Time going on? Here. Call it in. Which way did it go? That way. They're headed for the train station. Why aren't you chasing it? I'm gonna have to do some like slick maneuvers here. Why 
Why are they just watching it leave? They're over there! Why are you standing here then? Why are you just watching them? Brainbuster says watch out for chickens. Don't shoot, we need it alive. Also, it has a human child with it. Oh my god. I'm gonna get this little girl killed. Insane. Brainbuster says, "Get ready, roll." Hey, where are you going? I can't let them get away. They won't, and never make it to the other side. I can't take that chance. Now you will get yourself killed. Do not go after him, Connor. That's an order. Graphine says Elon Musk cars, no stop, no stop, zoom. <laughs> zoom. Get up, get up, get up! A car thrown over my car. <laughs> I need her to, to protect Alice, otherwise I would. That would be entertaining. Connor's just standing there. We should probably get moving. <laughs> I just got an achievement, run Kara, run. Are you kidding with this? I'm assuming that the other option down here is, like, Kara gets run over by a car. Like, if Kara dies, Alice is, Alice is going to die, too, probably. What is this whole other route? Oh, I bet you if it's, you stay in, like, the, uh... Hotel. Several sources do we have to do like several playthroughs of this? Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigations. We contacted Cyberlife for comment, but no longer. We are now approaching Ferndale Station. Why is this the worst chapter? I mean, is it because it's Marcus? Customers are reminded that all androids must run in the designated area. This place will make me free. Find Jericho. I don't have any, bud. Oh yeah? What do you say? Hi. Really? <laughs> Not surprised. Apparently she did. <laughs> yeah. I know. It's crazy, right? Does this make you uncomfortable? Oh yeah. Sure. I'll talk to you later. I wonder if, like, because remember the hot dog vendor? Okay, he's not gonna do anything. I bet you if you wait like five minutes, he'll do something. David Cage would do something stupid like this. Can he go back to Art Dad? That's a good question. I bet you he'd love him. Find the graffiti. Okay. Wow, it led me right to the graffiti. Who's talking? Yeah, 
Our dad would be like super into like having him as a son. Now that he's basically Find what symbol? There we go. He's basically hu like completely indistinguishable from humans. What is this? Why do I need to find different graffitis? I don't understand. So... On a lion. I mean, yeah, but they don't know that. Why do the androids have to take the stairs? What's the point of that? I mean, is it just like po it's it's segregation? It's pointless segregation. Do you know where Jericho is? Is it just? I I just don't understand. I mean, obviously, se no segregation is good, or no segregation makes sense. Also, I just realized I'm looking right at the uh, lion. Sproul says, do you not also make your vacuum cleaner sit in the back of the bus? I just... It doesn't make sense. Symbol and system. Oh, there's one. It's not. I can't see it on my screen, so. What am I looking for? It's supposed to be here, right? Oh, there. Yep. Yeah, thank you. I don't understand what this little mini game why why I'm getting this information. Like I need to find this random graffiti. Don't forget these. I think standards of life, so the segregation means there's a sense they're going walking toasters, no one should care about them, and standards taking down and stuff. I mean, yeah, that's I, I That being said, Sprawl, do you honestly believe, based on the last three months, that humans wouldn't act a hundred percent like this in a real life situation? I don't know if he is that bad at it. This seems pretty spot on. America like it, 35% unemployment or something like that. Can I read that somewhere like 28%? Yeah, most of the like actual advanced robotics. Uh, nowadays, they're coming out with that sort of stuff, M Duck. Like, the robots they're making these days look more and more like, uh, 
like humanoid figures. Yes, I know. The game's like poke information at me. I'm trying to look for the graffiti. I'm looking for like a purple stripe. Official unemployment peaked at like 18%. I thought I got higher than that. You hear about that artist, Carl Manfred? Yeah, I hope he makes it. I know. Where'd you hear that? Ooh, I read it somewhere. Oh, well, don't believe everything you read. Fake news, right? Sorry, was that topical enough of a joke? I went in a big circle. Where is this graffiti? It's over there. See something real quick. Where is that? Oh, that's a different one. New TTS. Not if you read me, General. Okay, yeah, I don't, I don't know why it's, uh, like, skipping some TTSs. Do the robots have two eyes? That is a very good question. I'm not looking for much. These robots. Non-sex robots have dicks. I mean, do they build robots, like, as companions? Like, like a housekeeping robot. Is it designed in the manual that maybe you might want to build a relationship with this robot? Like, do you want to build for that contingency? Did I, am I missing? Feel free to backseat me through this, because if you if you say this is terrible, I believe you. I already agree with you. If you see anything, or or let me know if I'm going the wrong direction. Looking for a wire fence. Thank you. Oh, it might be back in the uh, station, actually. Actually, no, it, it'd be... Uh... It's the side of a building. Maybe some nerd wouldn't have a Sailor Moon at hand? Yeah, definitely. 100%. Near where the last one was. This is where the last one was. Maybe not down there. Maybe over here? Same alleyway? Is it like right there? That looks like it might be something. Also, I like how I can jaywalk everywhere. there, but that is a chain alleyway, so I can see why you would think that. Let's look around. I'm not looking for much. 
There we go. There's the last one. No? Ah, there it is. Just QR code real quick. just don't understand why are we doing this what is who told us to do this I can't sympathize with the road I can sympathize with some of them I can't sympathize with Marcus Marcus is ridiculous Where's this other symbol? Am I an idiot? Oh, I need to like move, don't I? I mean, I care about Kara because of Alice. I care about Connor because of Hank. So, hey, I'm just as racist as everybody else in this character, you know, in this universe. What, who would have thunk it? What did I accomplish that? Or, oh, do I have to, like, climb on this, maybe? to look at now. Just that one. What is that? Is that the only thing I can see? Where's more symbols? Symbol one, symbol two. Is there any more? There is. I did not see Bicentennial Man. I like Kara. Move the mouse to select a route. Where's the route that I can send him directly into the pit? <laughs> can I make him do it anyways? Oh. I want the one where I chest. No, oh, man. Thanks for the gift of choice, David Cage. Super organs to make humans longer lived. Let's see. So is he an android? There's like a pop scare. I'm going to lose it. You, uh, 
You weren't kidding about this being the worst level. <laughs> nope. What else do we got? Which is the best way to parkour? Why does it tease me with like, this is how your character would die? Uh, is there another option? Even if it's like a re, you know, restore your progress kind of thing, I'd at least like to see it. You already programmed it. Just put in the character models. Raprine says, what if Prince of Persia, but simulated? <laughs> oh my god, I'm still looking for graffiti. Looking for like half a vault. Hello? Friendly? Hard to say. Man, we had a pretty good string of levels that weren't terrible. So is it this whole thing? It is. by far the worst it feels like the worst by far definitely like the what so far i mean agreed i'm done oh god it's already midnight jesus I was just about to turn around. So I wasn't paying attention to the uh, to the bridge. Like I thought I was going to look over here just to make sure I didn't uh I didn't miss anything. Maybe a magazine down here. Uh, maybe they jack into like the you know citywide grid or something. You just don't notice all the bandwidth. I don't think anyone's working on this boat right now. It all looks pretty abandoned. I mean, I just tried to walk over a bridge and it fell apart. Sure, I'll make him jump.
I was kind of hoping he'd just like wump into a ship. I certainly didn't. Oh, come on. Kinetic flashlights are not nearly that strong. Marcus have night vision? Apparently not. You think that would be useful to have as an android? There's gonna be a pop scare in here. You watch, some like half deformed robot's gonna jump out of the shadows. scanner. Maybe they want to be, like, ecologically friendly. I don't know. Maybe they wanted to be futuristic and a crank just seemed too old school. Here it comes, here it comes. Something's gonna, like, run out of the shadows at me. <laughs> Jesus fucking... do it again. It's gonna do it again. We'll just get your clips ready because it's gonna terrify me again and I'm gonna rage quit. That didn't scare me. Brain Buster says congratulations Raw, you have achieved the rank of Pussy Willow. You were startled your first time too. You, 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 you all, y'all are hard, but uh, first time you saw it, you, you, you were, you were spooked. I don't mean right now, because you knew it was coming. Or you might have known it was coming, I don't know. Sproul says, Raw, was that more or less scary than the tree stump from Spooky's House of Jump Scares? Ooh. Is this the way everybody gets to Jericho? Raffrine says they reset this every time someone new comes to Jericho. <laughs> oh, it's, what's his name? Welcome to Jericho. <laughs> Fall off catwalk. Robots, they look the same. That's racist. Slow hey! Hey, how you doing? Mm. Plastic with you? Temporary. <sighs> Usual. You know it. Coming up. Gotta rip the band-aid. I would love to do another chapter, but. Gotta be, gotta be the responsible adult. I gotta go get some sleep, because I gotta go to work tomorrow. I'm gonna peace out, boys. Thanks for hanging. Might do some more later. Peace out. <laughs>